Hello citizens and welcome back, it's nice to have you here. Some good news today regarding Bernardo Silva, before we get into it, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and as always, let's just jump straight in, shall we? Now Pep Guardiola has been speaking today, he said a little bit earlier on that he expects Bernardo Silva to stay next season because he's so important to what we do. And no complaints there, I'm not trying to talk for every City fan, but I think if you ask every City fan, we all agree that Bernardo Silva needs to stay. He's so, so important for what we do. Um, Last season, if we look at it, before Christmas in particular, you know, I think three, four months, he was absolutely incredible. He was our player of the season. He did everything, you know, he was scoring goals, he was creating chances, he was covering the defence. You know, he lets four players like De Bruyne do what he does, and he, he covers the defence as well and lets them push up and do their thing. And Pep's right, he's, he's incredibly important to what we do, you know. And I think from day one when he arrived, the City fans have taken to himself so well. He conducts himself well off the pitch and on the pitch is where he plays like a proper fan. He wears his hat on his sleeve, he fights for every ball and he never stops running. And that's what you want to see, you know. It's like he's a lifelong City fan when he plays. And you can see, you know, when him and Foden play, they're quite similar in that sense. They both play like they love the team, they love the badge. What more could you ask for? Now we saw before last season the City were willing to let him go. You know, we're trying to offload him so we can bring Kane in. And that was a huge mistake. We we all said it at the time, and I remember I said it at the time, let Bernardo go would be huge. And this season, I don't think we can let him go. You know, of course, we've got other players in the team that want to take up his position, and eventually we're going to have to see him move on. But right now, I think his role is it's one of those unsung roles, isn't it? It's, you know, you appreciate when he's on the pitch and when he's off the pitch, you know he's missing because the team just don't blow as well. They don't go forward as well. They they don't link up that well. And there just seems to be a massive hole. It's like when Rodri goes miss, but Rodri doesn't play. You know, you, you can tell there's something not right. The team just doesn't look well balanced. And I think, you know, if you're looking at starting 11s and must-have plays in the team, I'd be looking at De Bruyne, I'd be looking at Bernardo, I'd be looking at Rodri. Those three positions in the midfield are so, so key to what we do. And those plays work so well together. And they understand Pep, they understand the team, and they understand what they need to do. So yeah, Bernardo Silverstein is massive. And, I, you know, there was thought that Barcelona were coming in for him. And Pep mentioned it. He said that, you know, two clubs, you never really know what's going to happen in the transfer window. You know, if the player wants to leave, of course, we're going to let him go. Because Pep and the team have always had this thing where... You know, if the player wants to go, he goes. And we're seeing that right now with Sterling, which is going to be another video at some point, I imagine, when he leaves. You know, we're seeing that with Jay Seuss as well. He's adamant on leaving right now. And we saw it with um, Sane when he went. None of us wanted to see him go, but he went because he wanted to. And if Bernardo comes in in the 1st of July, you know, for preseason, and he says, look, I want to leave for Barcelona, the club are going to let him go. But hopefully he doesn't do that. And I can't see him doing that. You know, he's getting that game time. He's not like one of these rotation players for us. If he's fit, Pep's playing him. And I think that's testament to how good he is and how highly rated he is by Pep, even though we did try and offload him last summer, which was crazy. So yeah, that's it, really. That's the news. I'm not going to dwell on it too long. Let me know what you think in the comments about Bernardo. Let me know if you would keep him. I'd expect you are going to say we should keep him. But I think we all can all agree if he wants to leave, the club are probably going to let him go. Yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out. And um, yeah, make sure to hit that like button. See you again. Bye-bye.